Supine Dry Neck Massage Warming Up the Neck Because people are so sensitive in the neck region, it's a good idea to do a little bit of a warm-up by massaging the neck muscles without any oil before beginning the friction or myofascial therapy on the neck. Transverse Erector Pull-Through Place your middle and ring fingers at the center of the paraspinal muscles at the back of the neck at about the level of C4. With the right hand, move the skin laterally away from the spine, like this. Apply an anterior pressure as you sweep through the paraspinal muscles from lateral to medial. Do this several times and then repeat it at the same level on the left side. Gradually move up toward the occiput. and down toward the base of the neck, applying pressure in this way. Once you feel at ease with this, do it by alternating right and left hands at each level. Occipital Pressure Circles To apply a pressure circle, do not move over the skin, or in this case, the hair. You'll be making a small circle with light to mild pressure at first, moving along the base of the occiput to loosen up and relax the suboccipital muscles. Rotate the head to the left, gently supporting it with the left hand. Begin just medial to the mastoid process, and apply pressure with your middle, index, and ring fingers toward the center of the head. Make a small circle three or four times, applying a medium pressure. Then move medially by half-inch steps toward the occipital protuberance. Then repeat on the other side with the other hand. If the person is fairly relaxed, you can work more deeply by placing your hand in the index finger supported position, like this, performing the same technique with the tip of your index finger. For someone who's quite tense, this would be too much pressure. If the person can handle the pressure, apply more force and hook your finger under the occiput as you perform this technique. Lateral pressure circles. Now take the same pressure circle concept using a mild to moderate pressure with your right, middle and index fingers. Begin just inferior and posterior to the mastoid process and perform pressure circles as you slowly inch your way down toward the shoulder, working on the scalenes just behind the sternocleidomastoid muscles. Now work on those muscles on the left. You can also do these on the right and left sides simultaneously if the client is not too sensitive here.